Hey everyone, I have a new series of books I want to show you today. These are the Moodles Presents Doodles books. Um, these are all different um, types of books. They're kind of like... Um, they're, they're all really, really cute. This one's Grumpy, Happy, and Stressed. Um, there's more in the series, but these are just the ones that I collected. And today we're going to start with the Moodles Grumpy. This is a nice small size book, a little travel size. Um, Moodle your way through grumpiness. This illustrated collection of ideas to draw and doodle. Help to relieve your mood, whatever grumpy situation. So let me show you the idea of these books. What's a Moodle? Moodle is a doodle with the power to change your mood. So it's cheaper than therapy, quicker than chanting chakras, tasting tastier than a cabbage leaf and sandpaper detox. Ha! <laughs> a mo the Moodle, a simple thing that can really turn your day around. And it's just, um, you know, different pages that give you prompts. You can doodle things in, you know, turn the page upside down, it says, um, you can color in it, you can draw yourself here, scribble your frustration, color all the grass green, create a monster of your mood. things you can cut out the fortune teller um I don't know if an adult would do this but definitely kids teenagers would do this your moods throughout the day some adults may the bad moodle demon let him take over your pencil is possessed You just follow the prompts and go through it. It's really cute. It's kind of like those wreck this journal books, if I would say what I compare it to. Misery Love Company. Find a friend and Moodle together. <laughs> bad Hair Day? Give them all their own bad hair stuff. There's some really cute things in here to do. <clears throat> Fill your head entirely with happy thoughts. This one is the grumpy book, and now we have the happy book. We'll show you some pages in here. Same type of book. Moodle your guilt-free purchases. You're the star. Sketch yourself in a favorite TV show. Decorate your donuts. Draw your face on this stamp. I think, I think younger kids or you know teenagers, or whatever, would get a kick out of some of these pages. How to make a paper airplane. Just draw something. Stop and smell the roses. You can draw the roses on it. Draw your favorite dish.
draw yourself dancing. Write yourself a love letter with your left hand. Color in the picture. Connect the dots in any order you like. There's no right answer. Quick draw. Oh, draw a firework display. Draw a hippie happy t-shirt. Alright, that is the happy book. And we have one more, which I need, the stressed book. Let's see what the back looks like. I don't know how many they have in the series. These are just the ones that um I found. Let's get to alright, stressed. Don't stress the little things. I need you to meditate and empty your mind. Empty it onto this page and relax. Some of these pages are repeats, I've noticed. Draw a picture entirely in the calming color of blue. Focus on the big picture. Dump your emotional baggage. I mean, some of the prompts are neat. I don't know. Let me know down at the bottom if you think this is more for a kid or for an adult. I'm not sure. It was in the adult section. Write, write a breakup letter to your stress. I don't have enough paper for that. Draw four people who really bother you. Oh, wow. I can do that. Then close the book and walk away. <laughs> Repeatedly write, my stress will disappear over and over until it no longer legible. Oh no, here's your evil stress monster. Moodle it some wings and watch it fly away. Draw 10 things you worry about. Then scribble out 8.5 of them because 8.85% of the things you worry about never happen. You versus stress. Short on time, here's an extra week. Fill it in however you want. <laughs> if only it worked that way, huh? Having a pet reduces stress, so draw in your own fluffy friend. Important to achieve balance in your life, draw a symmetric noodle. Draw your stress head, then squash it in the page of this book. Wow. Not to compare yourself, draw a little ship on Wednesday for the next four weeks. Notice the merits of each drawing, but don't compare them. Loosen up. Take two different colors and make them fight on this page. Who won? <laughs> Some of these are really cute. Color your aura. They're really, really cute books. Um, so we have the happy, the grumpy, and the stressed. If you, um, thanks for watching, guys. If you haven't subscribed, I would really appreciate it if you did. And hit that like button. It really helps me out. Thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye.